What's up guys, it's Danny Jackal here and today I'm gonna be doing a Q&A. All right, so I'm currently quarantining in my house. I am in my backyard and the dropout gang has created some questions for me. Um, I haven't looked at any of them yet. This is my first time looking at them. So let's see how it goes. First question, where are you from? I'm from San Diego, California. I've always grown up here my whole life, but I go to school in Arizona. Dad bod or six pack? Fortunately, I'm gonna have to go with six pack. Sorry for all the dad bods out there. Um, I don't, it doesn't need to be like a full six pack, you know? I'm fine with a four pack, a two pack. That's fine with me. But like a full dad bod, it's kind of a lot to handle, too much to handle. Have I ever been arrested? I am so proud to say that I have never been arrested. And I've done some crazy sh for sure. Not trying to brag, I know I'm cool. But yeah, I haven't been arrested shockingly. I am surprised. What is my Instagram? It is at Danny Jackal. That is at Danny Jackal, D-A-N-I-J-A-C-K-E-L. How did you join the Daily Dropout? Okay, so many people have been asking me this question. So I first joined Daily Dropout, I was a sophomore in college and Dawson direct messaged me, which is so random. I thought it was spam at first, I didn't know who Dawson was. And it said, are you interested in acting? And weirdly enough, I've always wanted to be an actress my whole life. It's like a dream of mine, but you know, I don't know if that's gonna end up happening because I also really like doing YouTube stuff. But I was like, yeah, that's like been a huge dream of mine. And he was like, okay, do you wanna do film a video for Daily Dropout? And I'm like, what? Like, you mean, are you gonna prank me or something? I thought it was stage. And he's like, no, no, I mean like you prank people. And I'm like, the f Like, <laughs> I did not know that like why why me, you know? But it ended up being the best thing ever because I have so much fun doing it. So I'm super glad. Am I a dropout? I am not, actually. I know it is weird to work for Daily Dropout but not actually be a dropout. But I am a senior in college. I am almost graduated. Technically, I am graduated. Uh, but yeah, I've been there for four years and I'm proud to say that I have not dropped out. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Do I like hairy guys? What are these questions? <laughs> um, uh, you know, like a little, uh, like an average amount of hair is fine. I think too much, like, like I'm thinking Goldilocks style here. Like, you know, just enough, but not like too much, too little. Uh, I'll just go with that. Who is the best prankster on Daily Dropout? Okay, I think that Steven is really, really clever. And I think overall, prank-wise, he, he's really up there. But I think that Laura has, like, she has balls for sure. And she's not afraid to do anything or say anything. So it's pretty, it's pretty up there. But Steven is, I mean, he just, the German accent kills me. So he might win for that. What is my favorite video that I've filmed? Gosh, these are hard questions. Um, I wish I, like, saw this before so I could think and prepare. The how big is it one was so fun. Um, I just had a quick question. Yeah. I was just wondering like how big is it? How big Like is both of you. Like five-ish on a good day? Yeah. I'm, on a good day? I'm like yeah, okay. solid on a good day. Okay. I mean, I guess that's, that'll suffice. And the awkward body compliment one, which I did so long ago, I thought that one was so fun to do because I could get really creative with it. Hi. What's up? How are you? I'm all right, what about you? I'm good. I just like couldn't help but notice. I mean, your head is so proportionately placed onto your neck. Like it's, I love it. You know. Nice. Is there any? Wait, can you turn this way for one sec? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yep. That is perfect angle. This way. Okay. That is. I mean, that's crazy. It's it's perfect. List two pet peeves. I think everything bothers me really, I don't have to. No, I'm just kidding. I would say one of them for sure is when people chew with their mouth open, like that's just so, like I just wanna punch them in the face when I do that and like close their mouth for them. Also, okay, this sounds really weird. I don't know if people can relate to this, but when you're sleeping and like, it's, this is so specific, when you're sleeping in the car or something and someone like kind of like, like brushes by you, 
and when you're in like a really light sleep where you're trying to sleep but someone like brushes by you and you're like just like stop touching me i don't know why that bothers me so much but it does or not even like sleeping just next to someone in class or something and they're like their backpack is touching you or something i don't know like a little brush against the skin really just bothers me for whatever reason all right have i ever been kicked out of a bar or house party i don't think i've been kicked out of a house party but uh i've definitely been kicked out of a few bars uh definitely not once my favorite drink obviously alcohol but <laughs> i'm just kidding alcohol is up there probably but I love Slurpees, even though there's a lot of sugar. They're both bad for your health, but what can I say? Favorite type of food, 150% without a doubt sushi. That's like, I could eat that, I could live off sushi and be so fine. Okay, what is the title of the current chapter of your life? Uh, it'd probably be, I am stressed. If you could change your name, what would it be? I would change my name to Danny, probably because it sounds weird, but my full name is Danielle. So I would fully change it to Danny, like on paper, that kind of thing. Because the way people say Danielle, it's like, oh, I can't even say it, it makes me gag. Um, but it's like super cringy, and I just, I hate when it, like, I don't know the way it sounds. So I like Danny more. Big hands or big feet? I don't know if that means like, do I like big hands more or big feet or do I have big hands or big feet? So, okay, I'm gonna answer both. If I, do I have big hands or big feet? I have, I have both small feet. Okay, that's in small hands. <laughs> that's not the question. I kind of like when people have like both big hands and big feet. Actually, is that weird? No, I think big hands. Yeah, I like, when people have big hands, like I have really small hands and I don't, especially right now, I haven't got my nails done in too long. Um, so yeah, maybe big hands. Okay, what would be my dream date? Uh, for me, it's weird. I like don't really expect, I don't really need like the nicest things. I would say I'm not looking for a super fancy dinner. I actually find those like almost more awkward, especially in the beginning of like dating someone. Um, I think just like chilling on the beach and like sunset, watching sunset and like, eating food on a blanket or something. I don't know, I just feel like that's more laid back and normal. What's a habit you can't break? I mean like probably just some like OCD stuff. Like I always feel like I'm like such a germ freak that it's weird because like my actual room is a disaster. Like my living space in my room embarrassing to say but it is a disaster but actual like cl like cleaning my like hands wise like I feel like I always need to wash my hands and I can't have like when people touch my pillow like I don't know what it is I get like mm, like or it can't fall on the ground um I just like wish I didn't really care as much about that and that is all we have I hope you guys got to know me a little bit better. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it lots. Don't forget to subscribe to Dropout Gang, obviously. And don't forget to subscribe to my personal channel. It will be in the description below. Thank you guys so much and peace out.